How's it going everyone? My name is AJ and today I'm going to answer a fitness question. Branch chain amino acids have been trending upward in the health and fitness community as more and more research comes out supporting their effectiveness. But what exactly are they? And are they worth investing in to take your workouts to the next level? I am going to answer this question from a scientific perspective. So without further delay, let's get started. Amino acids are biochemical building blocks for your muscles, and your body contains 20 of them, nine of which are deemed essential, meaning that your cells cannot manufacture them. As a result, you need to get them from your diet in order to effectively build and repair muscle. Of these nine essential amino acids, three of them fall in the branched chain category, leucine, isoleucine, and valine. When you're deep into a hard workout, these three amino acids decrease significantly due to muscle degradation. Some evidence suggests that replenishing these BCAAs during exercise is going to do three things. First, they are going to delay the onset of fatigue, which means you get more workout volume in, and more workout volume means a greater increase in muscle size and strength. Secondly, they are going to facilitate protein synthesis, which means your body can spend more time building and repairing skeletal muscle. And lastly, it is thought that taking BCAAs during your workout may lead to a direct or indirect effect on decreasing muscle soreness. So does this mean that you should stock up on these biochemical powerhouses? Or is there other information to consider? Let's take a closer look. It's important to consider that most people already get a pretty good dosage of BCAAs through their diet alone, especially if you're someone who consumes a lot of high protein foods like meat, eggs, beans, and of course, whey protein. But some of these foods are a little less convenient to access when you're right in the middle of a workout. BCAAs in a supplement variation are free form, which means they require no digestion and are very rapidly absorbed into the bloodstream, which will have a much more immediate impact than consuming a protein shake. Because of this, I recommend taking BCAAs only during your workout so that they can be put to use immediately and so that you are not going to be creating any expensive pee. And in order to reap the benefits of BCAAs, you need to be pushing your body to the limit during your workouts. If you decide to use BCAAs and you are doing less than five hard workouts a week, you are likely not doing enough to reap the true benefits of BCAAs. And in my opinion, you should just stick to whey protein. To get maximum value from BCAAs, you should be taking them during your workouts and only if you are really pushing yourself to the limit. So what are BCAAs and should you be taking them? Branch chain amino acids are biochemical building blocks that are essential for your body to synthesize protein. And in order to reap the full benefit of BCAAs, I recommend performing a minimum of five intense workouts a week and only be taking the supplement during the workouts. But what are your thoughts on BCAAs? Feel free to let me know in the comments below or on Facebook or Twitter. And if you enjoyed this video, be sure to like it, share it with your friends and subscribe. Thank you so much for watching and stay strong.